Hey guys, RC here, back with Club 3, episode 90 of Football Manager. We are with West Brom. So, uh, we've only played one match, a 4-2 win over Wolves. Danny Olmo with a brace, Eric Garcia, Isa Chukwuma. Four goals in a 12-minute span, and then uh, they picked up two second-half goals after we called off the dogs. 4-2 win. Uh, we're back for AS Monaco, so either we're going to play... You may or may not see this episode, of course, as always. If you don't, you'll never know. <laughs> if you do, then I just kind of let it out of the bag. Uh, but we're going to either do both Europa legs, or if we just dominate in this one, uh, then we'll come back maybe for Monaco United, and you'll you'll never see this one. So let's get to it. Uh, we are, with that win, we've jumped up to ninth on goal differential with Villa. So let's get to it. All right, we are on the road in the first leg. We are the underdogs. So I want to go with that tactic. Franashini up top. Actually, I want to go with Chikwuma up top. Let's do that. Franashini on the bench. Because we've gone to this one striker tactic, uh, Bozdag has not been getting a lot of playing time. Uh, pick up where you left off. That would be great. Oh, a heavy touch and then a heavy tackle. I think this is as far as we're expected to make it. We're going to praise. All right. Harris in some space. Oh, he lays it off to Ingram. Crossed in. Oh! Chikwuma should have had that follow-up right there. Oh. That was unlucky. We've only had one tackle. Are you kidding me? All right, Caputo plays it out wide. Danny Olmo. Olmo's been hot. We got an email recently that uh, somebody thought he should win player of the year. Up to Olmo. Laid back to Walter. Laid outside to Niambi with a run. Oh, unlucky. Ingram lays it off to Strobel. Deep ball to Walter, crossed in. Ingram with his left peg into the net, number 10 on the season. Ingram has been on fire from that winger position, man. 10 goals, that's solid out of that spot. We're starting to put some shots together, but still only a one goal advantage. Right, they're on the attack. Ball out to Mulecki. What the hell? Oh, what the hell? Oh, come on. Oh, I thought he had a clean header on that. What the shit was that? Bushilla, number four. Wee wee. Well, that was crap. That was like the Champions League penalty yesterday. I thought that was cheesy. Ingram lays it off short to Niambi. He drives it inside. Oh, no! Off the woodwork. Oh, that should have been in the net. That should have been in the net. All right, Walter. Into Olmo. Back to Walter. Crossed in. There it is. Harris, number nine. He's one of our central midfielders. Nine goals out of out of that spot. We're putting some goals in the net this year. You know, I'm pretty happy. All right. I feel better now, but again, only a one goal advantage. He got booked. I thought that was that was not good. Uh excellent efforts. Play it calm. What's uh, on our tactic here? Yeah, I've got get stuck in and tighter marking. Hmm. 
Hmm. It's weird. We only had one one tackle, and they had like twelve. All right, we're gonna praise them. I think they had a good first half. All right, Boschilla into the net. Oh, that was crap. That was a horrible header out by Garcia. I've given up a couple of real cheesy-ass set pieces here lately. Uh, demand more. Come on, boys. Uh, I'm going to actually, let's make a sub here. He's struggling. Let's put Coleman in. Um, Matt Ingram, Brendan Taylor. I hate losing Ingram on the field, but need some fresh legs. Still, two away goals. I think I'll be happy if we can... Uh, I don't want to lose, though. I think I'll be happy with a draw, but I'd like to eke a win here. I mean, we deserve it for sure. LaFont. And Danny Olmo. Mid-left. Let's put Ramon Esteban out there. Oh, there's a nice ball. Chukwuma. Lays it off. Olmo. Oh, he's tackled right at the edge of the box. Oh, nice interception by Taylor. Horrible pass up the pitch. All right, there we go. Harris. Brady. Danny Olmo on the run. Crossed in. Oh, there it is. Brendan Taylor off the bench with his seventh of the season. Oh, that is going to be nice. Yes. All right. Oh, come. Okay, disallowed. Offsides. Gebbles. I think, I think I've had him before. French. Not, on the, not in this save. 72 caps. Gavels, gavels. I think I had him. Maybe my lead save last year. Interesting. Um, let's go with tactics uh, in possession. Let's go with uh, more time wasting. All right, so he was off sides, thank goodness. Ooh, yeah, he was actually behind, yeah, barely a step. We'll take that, though. Crossed in. Taylor finds some space, lays it through Brady. Oh, it would have been nice to have gotten that one extra away goal. Come on, boys. Oh, there's a little time wasting going on. Plays it short to Esteban. Walter, edge of the penalty box. Brady, Esteban, hoofed out. Oh, my God. Uh, that could have been a red card, maybe. Harris plays it short. Niambi, again. Cleared out. Oh, man. We are not capitalizing on some of these chances. Strobel playing the deep center field. Back to Caputo. Blow the whistle. Hoofed out. Come on. El Amrani. Oh, he made his uh, debut with uh, the Netherlands, uh, with the Dutch, his first cap. All right, I think that's big. Three to two. Yeah. All right, excellent efforts. So, yeah, it's close enough. So what I'm going to do is I'll play the next two league matches off camera. We'll come back for the second leg of the home leg uh, here in Europa League. So I'll see you back here momentarily. 
Well, the two matches in between did not go anywhere near as planned. We went with our starting 11 and lost 1-0. Dan Froggett scored in the 48th minute. Uh, this one, we had a, a 30 to 10 shot advantage, 10 on target, six chances, just not finishing, not finishing at all. And then we uh, got drubbed five to two by Burnley. We outshot them, but only by one. Just played crappy. You know, we actually played a slightly rotated squad, but we had, you know, we had guys here. Uh, Franaschini, uh, uh, one of our two starting strikers, uh, was injured. Uh, speaking of, let's take a look at goal scoring. So uh, Chikwuma's got 22, 19 for Olmo from that left winger position. 16 for Franaschini, uh, 11 for Ingram from the right wing, and uh, Harris with nine, Brendan Taylor with seven off the bench. He's been really solid. So, you know, we've got diverse scoring, just, yeah. All right, let's get into today's match. Uh, if you wonder why I'm looking up, it's I'm trying to see my monitor. Uh, uh, I mentioned I had surgery about a week ago. Uh, my diabetes is kind of out of whack because of the surgery. Uh, and when you have diabetes, uh, one of the things that's affected is your vision. In fact, diabetes, just a public service announcement, uh, diabetes is the leading cause of blindness and uh, limb amputation. So, uh, you know, you definitely want to not get diabetes if you can afford, avoid it. Uh, but if you do have it, make sure you're trying to control it as well, which I am. Uh, but uh, yeah, right now the eyes are, you know, I wear prescription glasses, but right now with the blood sugar, uh, the eyes are out of whack. So, uh, you know, it's, it's almost easier to see without them, but I can see like right there helps me out. I have bifocals so right there. Usually I would look here and I can't see that. So uh, that's why I look a little odd if I'm, if you notice I'm looking around. All right, we are at home. We are favorites. It is wet. I am going to play... I think I'm going to be a little defensive here. You know, screw that. No, 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 no. All right, so Omo cannot play. Um... Hofton, he's unregistered. So Cooper, Olmo is at 81. Is he on the bench? Hmm. I'm still going to play him. Screw it. And El Amrani. Walter Strobel. Hmm. I think I'm going to put Strobel on the bench here. If I can find him. There he is. Strobel. Caputo, Chukwuma, Esteban. Esteban's got some pace. He's one of our, you know, he's, yeah, he's 28. He's a backup. Um, where is... Bosdag six one five eleven I tell you what, I really want I want Bosdag in there. But Let's put uh, 
Let's put Esteban on the bench. El Amrani. Damn. Strobel. I guess that's not going to matter. All right. Well, let's get to it and hope we can uh, get through. That would be nice. God, I can't believe we lost both freaking league matches. Prove a point today. And those were low-ranked teams. I think they were 15th and 16th overall. Uh, let's see. We are... We are in the white. Well, white and blue, I suppose. Garcia. Lumps it up. Intercepted. Nice tackle. Brady in the right place. Plays it through. Chikwuma. You got to finish those guys. Got to finish. All right. Sinclair back from injury. Garcia off target with the header in the box. Let's see. Let's drop this a little bit so we can see everybody. All right. Danny Olmo, I gave him the start. Hey, who's down there? Hey, George. How's it going, bud? Bosdag lays it off to El Amrani. Right to the keeper. Oh, nobody made the run. Nobody made the run. Oh, nice header to Chikwuma. Into Taylor. Taylor puts it near post. Number eight on the season. Yes, 4-2 aggregate advantage. So they've got to beat us 4-1 now. 5-1. 5-1. Oh, he, caught, he sat the keeper down. Good play by Taylor. Praise. Man, yeah, we definitely have some match congestion going on here. I tried to do that, uh, a rotated squad, that last match, but boy, that that backfired as we got drilled that five to two. Back into Sinclair, tries to touch it inside, turned on Boschilla. Oh, God. We're giving up some cheesy-ass goals on these set pieces. You remember that one they had from about there, and they played it right down on the edge, and the guy just beat everybody off the line and had an easy touch in? That was pathetic. Okay. No, they'd only have to beat us 3-1, to one, not 4-1. to one. All right, encourage. All right, they're frustrated, but that's okay. They can come right to the locker room and cry about it. All right, uh, let's go to tactics. All right, Danny Olmo is dead. We're going to put Cooper out there. Uh, everybody else looks good. Pep talk. Excellent efforts. Declan, play it calm. <sighs> Come on, boys. Praise. Off target. Another set piece. Boy, these make me nervous now. Like that one. I would have expected that one to float over Caputo and go into the net. All right. Uh, we've already made one sub. Uh, da, da, da. Coleman. Declan Rice. 
I'm Ronnie. Defensive right. Strobel can play the left side, can he? He's 84. He should be good. Let's put him right there. I think that upgrades is a little bit. Not a lot, but a little bit. All right, he lumps it. Chikwuma. Oh, taken down. Come on, that was a breakaway. Oh, I don't know, man. That should have been a red, maybe. Just maybe. All right, Golovin. Pellegri. Boschilla. Shot. It's high. Golovin headed out. Bozdag. Breakaway. Turn around and run the other way, dude. Give him a runner. Like right there. McGuire plays it through. Brady. All right, Chikwuma jumps on it. Drops it back inside. Nobody was there. Gebbles. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Is that going to be a yellow? Oh, boy. Either offsides or a pit. No, our guy was walking for it. Thank God. <laughs> uh, I think I've already made two subs. All right, there we go. Um, damn. Sinclair. Mid-center. Not really. Coleman. Tell you what, let's bring Coleman in on the yellow. Try to solidify the defense. All right. Praise and oh, tactics in possession. And let's go to a little more time wasting. Should have done that about five or ten minutes ago. Bosdag. Strobel. Bosdag into the middle. Brady. Find Sinclair. Touch! Right into the corner of the net. What a shot by the midfielder. He's been he's missed some games this year with injury. That should clinch it for us, fellas. 5-3 on aggregate. Oh my goodness. Waste all the time you want. Blow the whistle, blow the whistle. Offsides, excellent. Come on, it was only three minutes. There we go, 5-3 on aggregate, 2-1 win at home. Sinclair with the with the uh, 91st minute goal. Uh, excellent efforts. It's really this season has been so weird that the you know when we should lose it's like we we we're competitive or win and when we should dominate we we can't do crap all right i want to get to the emails here here we go all right so first leg triumph quarterfinals 1.75 million uh sinclair your passing was really good uh, yes, his lengthy spell on the sideline. Six weeks with sprained knee ligaments. Player of the match. Excellent. All right, so here's the semifinal. Man City, Roma, Olympic Lyon. Lyon. All right, who do we want? I don't think it matters. Maybe, I don't think it matters. All right, we got Roma. And they are the home team. So that's fine. And this will be on April 26th. So we've got a couple of matches rearranged. 
So, yeah, I think what we'll do is we'll, I'll play these three Premier League off camera. We'll come back and we'll do... Uh, I'll do Southampton because we haven't done a Premier League in a while. And then we'll do... So we'll do the final four matches here. And then maybe that gets us, you know, if we advance. Um, we're in the final four. So, yeah, this you know we could be in the championship for one more match. And that would be the season finale and we could do a wrap up if we would get lucky enough to get that far. Uh, taking a look at competitions, we were supposed to reach the quarters, uh, which we did. We actually won the quarters, so I think the board should be extremely happy. Well, they're only 75%. Uh, we're we're mid-table. Yeah, minus one. I'm, I'm, not, I'm not happy. Is it my keeper? Caputo. Fifty four goals in thirty three matches, six shutouts, seven allowed, seven shutouts in Europa League. So he's playing well at Europa League level, but he's given up some goals in the Premier. So I, I just think what it is is we just aren't the talent that, you know, and, and honestly, if we look, right, we don't have any five stars. We've got a couple, a couple of four stars, handful of three and a half stars, and then we've got three stars and under. And if we look at our starters, I mean, you know, yeah, he's not. Uh, let's do... No, I want to pick without restriction from the entire team. There we go. All right, so, I mean, Niambi's a two-and-a-half star, right? Coleman is a two-and-a-half star with three-and-a-half potential. Walter is a two-and-a-half with two-and-a-half potential. You know, but these guys were all upgrades, right? I mean, these are our starters. So, yeah, I think we've got to upgrade. Let's take a quick look at transfers as well. Uh, no, it would be coming in. Oh, we signed this guy. Uh, you know, I'm looking, I'm not looking to blow the budget and, and screw up our, our financial fair play, but I am looking for young players that are, relatively inexpensive so he's going to join end of season so he doesn't affect us this year unfortunately he's an 18 year old colombian with no caps five u20s he got a tentative work visa but only for the u23s uh so but he has a two star current with five star potential so my goal with him is to loan him out, develop him, and then hopefully either sell him for a shitload of money or get him to where he qualifies, that we can do his contract where then he can qualify to be on the main club. Because I think the requirement there is a $541,000, and he's only making two oh three. So, you know, that's... Um, you know, that's the issue there. Uh, but we are doing well financially. We made a million dollars last month. We're currently two and a half million up this month. Uh, so we're at 116 million overall. We are still failing financial fair play because we're about 10 million over our player expenditures. Um, so honestly, I think I've only failed this once. If you remain in the same division, you get a deduction of five points the following season. All right, which means we're you know we're not we're gonna have to make sure we control that. Um, I don't know what this goes up per year, but it's so it's allowed at one fifteen. So next year should be I don't know maybe one twenty or so. I don't know how much that goes up. We're we're still gonna make a hundred and ninety-eight million dollar profit. Uh we're nine point eight four million over. 
So, you know, it's too late to sell anybody, and I'm not really, you know, if we go five points, what's the worst that could happen? We'd be at uh, 39, so we'd be in 12th position. But we've we've struggled this year. 17 losses? Yeah, I mean, that's just, that's unusual. So, anyway. So, thanks for watching. I'm going to play these three. We'll come back for the opening leg with Roma and Southampton. And then we'll close out with Roma Arsenal. And then maybe we'll have one more match after that in the Europa League finals. Maybe. Be nice to hoist some silverware for, for uh, a season. But uh, thanks for watching. Pound the like button. Subscribe if you don't mind. Let me know what you guys are thinking in the comments. Uh, let me know what you think I need to upgrade or how I can address uh, issues on the club. And uh, much appreciated. Talk to you guys later. Bye.